Settles. Sent on their way from the 1200 meter marker. First one out is Indian Tractor. Flamorosa's right there. Asian Star with the white blinkers. Wolf Killers amongst the leading division early on. On the outside of that is Philosopher. On Your Life is near the rail. The yellow cap about five lengths off the leader. Then Turf Conqueror. Dark Moon Rising is about seven lengths off the leader. Main Flyers just in front of that one. And then comes Royal Yavan. They really stretched out as they move towards the 700 meter marker. Asian Star leading it. It's in front by three lengths. Philosopher and Indian Tractor. Then Flamorosa followed by On Your Life. That's about six or seven lengths off the leader. Wolf Killers further back in the run. Then comes Turf Conqueror towards the outside. Dark Moon Rising. Asian Star went very quick leader, but On Your Life starts to move in now. Philosopher. Indian Tractor's down the inside. Dark Moon Rising's on the outside. On your life, though, hit the front past the 200. Indian Tractor tries to fight on. Turf Conquerors are running down the inside, and Dark Moon Rising's coming on strongly on the outside. Dark Moon Rising's coming to get them all. Dark Moon Rising won it. Indian Tractor second, close for third. Turf Conqueror or On Your Life. Number 12, Dark Moon Rising, makes up the ground, the ideal world. And wins it well here, Ashton Aries, Paul Lafferty, a first-timer, wins it about a length and a half, was green makeup, some good ground, you heard from Paul, it was, and he's money that shortened uh, Dark Moon Rising. Indian Tractor, the toad favourite, runs second. Third, perhaps also on the far side, but we'll wait for that. Turf Conqueror, and then nearest us, On Your Life, then came Seattle Spell, and they were followed by As You Please, and further back in the field, Royal Yavan, and then came Wolf Killer. So the winners on the right-hand side, the black sleeves and cap, same colors as Ole Gunner, and starts to make the progress. Indian Tractors with the red silks in the middle, and towards the outside, On Your Life, two of Conquerors running on down the inside, but the victory is for number 12, Dark Moon Rising, being a first-timer. So it also, with the pick six, the horse that has run, uh, that will be Indian Tractor, will survive the pick six. That is the running of the third race until the running of... Well, we got it from the horse's mouth during the week. Dark Moon Rising and Turf Conqueror, two horses showing really good work. But Dark Moon Rising, a horse with a bit of a future. And when he walked into the ring, he had that X factor about him. Yeah, he's, 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 he's a very nice horse. You're always concerned how he's going to do here. But the, I think the, the, the value uh, being a good draw as opposed to stable mate who ran a great race having the deep draw. But it's, it's always good when they win first time out. I think he's got a future to go further. I must thank uh, Nardis Lottering. He's the man behind this horse. Thank you very much, Nardis. And uh, I thank the boys for coming in. I said to him, the, the horse has come available. He looks like he'll be a very nice horse, and uh, I'm, I'm really chuffed. Well done. Thank you. Phil's going to jump in. We're going to have a chat with the connections. Now, he left it on the track today. He's a lovely-looking specimen. Yeah, I must say, we're very impressed with the way it looked. We were very excited the way he uh, came back and won the race because uh, in the running and at the start, I was a little bit perturbed. Last 200 metres, when you saw him sweeping up the outside, you must have thought, that's it, Pepe. I think I was louder, shouting louder than everybody else in the stand. <laughs> well done. Thank you very much. Doug come through, coming to the course with the first time, and never easy, but he's come through with flying colours. Wonderful. Yeah, Left spoke to me a couple of weeks ago, and he said, look, I'm speaking to you first. Very nice horse. Are you keen? I looked at him, just took it, and I said, long as it runs in my colours. <laughs> you got the patrons and all the connections. Well done. Well done. And also, if you see the cover of the uh, computer form, the colours are winning there. So. Super. And Allegana. Great, great thing. Thank you to Leff and all the staff at home. They've done a great job and they're doing a really great job with all the horses and it's really great to see things are going well. Enjoy it. Pleasure. Thanks, sir. Let's get Ashton Aries across. He's going to come through. He's doing the business for the Paul Lafferty stable. He looked a little bit green early on? Yes, you know, he was very green early on from our point, point of view. I think he's always just prepared to go over more distance. But he won well. Just want to say a big thank you to Mr. Lefty once again for the opportunity to involve in the owners. Keep up the hard work. How long till that four kilogram comes to an end? Because you're racking up the winners very quickly. What are you on now? The diamonds are 17. Well done. So a few more and then we're going to lose that claim. Yes, sir. Super. Thank you, sir.
Well done to the entire team. We've just seen number 12, Dark Moon, rising. Money was spot on from 14 to 1 down, and he's come through with flying colors.